Welcome to our comparison video on switching from 245 70ths R17 to 285 70ths R17. The diameter difference between these tire sizes is 7.2%, which exceeds the acceptable 3% range. This means the interchange is not recommended without making significant adaptations to your vehicle. Larger tires like the 285 70ths might require modifications such as leveling or lift kits to accommodate their size and prevent rubbing issues. Switching to the 285 70ths increases the diameter by 2.2 inches, which in turn raises the vehicle's ground clearance. This increase could improve your vehicle's ability to navigate obstacles and rough terrain, making it more suitable for off-road driving. The width difference between these tire sizes is significant, with the 285 70ths being 1.57 inches wider. This increased width will result in a larger contact patch, potentially improving traction and stability. However, it may also increase rolling resistance and affect fuel efficiency. The sidewall height increases by 1.1 inches with the 285 70ths. This larger sidewall height could result in improved ride comfort, especially on rough roads or off-road conditions, due to better impact absorption. With the larger 285 70ths tires, the speedometer will read lower than the actual speed. For example, at a speedometer reading of 20 miles per hour, the actual speed will be 21.45 miles per hour. Based on our observation, switching to 285 70ths R17 offers benefits such as increased ground clearance, potentially improved off-road capability, and better ride comfort due to the taller sidewall. The wider tread may also provide better traction in various conditions. However, the shortcomings include the need for vehicle modifications to accommodate the larger size, potential negative impacts on fuel efficiency due to increased rolling resistance, and the necessity to recalibrate or mentally adjust for speedometer inaccuracy. The change in handling characteristics and center of gravity should also be considered, especially for on-road driving. 